Claire, you find anything? What are you? Claire gets this music box, this Chinese wish box. Seven wishes. I wish my family had a better life. Get in! What is happening right now? Well, Claire starts realizing there's a blood price that goes along with each one of these wishes. <laughs> That's where the horror element of the movie really takes shape. We have very, very unique ways of killing people. Everything that happens is something that could like feasibly happen. You know, like freak accidents. It's all potentially possible, which is why it scares me to death. I believe any kind of horror or thriller has to be approached as realistic as possible. That was the right answer. Because the more believable it is, and then the scarier it is. Mama? When you see what the box has done, it's gonna upset you, for sure. <laughs> there were times when we were shooting a scene and it was just so quiet, and they would lift up the box by the rig, and the music would play and I would just get chills down my spine. I'm just scared of the box. I'm always like looking around, like making sure like there's weird noises. I'm like, what's going on? <laughs> and the thing that's so amazing about the way this movie looks is it's because of John's background as a DP. Obviously he shot The Conjuring and Insidious and directed Annabelle and so he's really well versed in the genre. Oh my god, that's so gnarly. I love this. Horror movies allow filmmakers to use their craft to be able to grab an audience, invest them in the characters, get under their skin, and then scare the out of them. Hello? I love scaring people. It's gonna scare the crap out of people. What's wrong with you? 